show you how to create a high score in MIT App Inventor. Uh, I've created a design screen here. We have a label that just basically says high score, a label for high, which is the label we're going to change, current score, uh, which is this, and then a zero uh, labeled here underneath there for the current score. And then we have a, a button for the score button and a reset. Something new that we're going to use here for our storage is our tiny db storage so if you come down here you can see the tiny db storage and that can be dragged in as a non-visible component so again my goal is when i hit this button for me to change my current score to go up by one and if my current score is greater than my high score i want to store that high score uh, and have that uh, be saved in our storage unit so the first thing I'm going to do is initialize a few variables and I'm just going to initialize a high score variable and then a variable for score. I'm going to set both of those on initialization to zero because we have yet to play our game. Uh, we have our score button. When our score button is clicked, I want to change that variable. So I'm going to change that uh, global score variable to getting that global variable plus one. So I'm going to get that high score, get that uh, score variable, and I'm going to add one to it. So what this is basically doing is it's increasing our variable every time that button is being clicked. But we have to set our current score label. So I'm going to come here to our current score label. To display, I'm going to come here to the text of that, and I want to display that global score variable now. Now, I need to create a, a function for this. So I'm going to come over uh, to my procedures, and I'm going to write a procedure. And my procedure is going to be if my global score is greater than my high score. So I'm going to grab my greater than block. If I can find it. Oh, here it is. Equals. To, so I'm going to do choose this to be uh, greater than. Well, what do I want to have, have, have happen? I want to check my current score to see if it's greater than my high score. If it is, I'm going to take my high score variable and I'm going to set it as my current score. So I'm going to duplicate this and now I need to display that, but I have that high score uh, label, I'm re but I want to display my high score, not my current score. Now I'm going to come to my storage, my tiny DB storage, and I'm going to uh, call then this storage to uh, store that variable. So I'm going to come here, I'm going to duplicate that get high score. And what I'm going to tag it under is just the word high. That's the searchable option on this. So what will happen now is I'll keep track of my score, but I need to use my reset button. So when my reset button is clicked, I want to set my current score to zero. And I want to dis display that. I can grab this piece of code. The only thing missing now is me calling this procedure. I'm going to call this procedure here. So when this is clicked, Every time it's clicked, we're calling this. If global score is greater than the high score, uh, then we're going to do this and store our display and store it. If it's not, we're going to come back up. So if I come to my emulator now, I can go to my score count. I can score. I can reset, and we can see that high score value is kept there. It's going to be kept there until I go above 22. When I go above 22, it'll reset and 